When I first realised that there was an opportunity to develop a computer-controlled, needle-free drug delivery, I started off by building this. And so the initial needle-free drug delivery technology actually involved contractile artificial muscle fibres. And these would contract and uh, press on a piston and fire drug out the end. The way the company got together, I had done my PhD with a very famous professor at MIT, Professor Ian Hunter. He said, look, you know, I've got this great technology in my lab. It's ready for prime time. You should go and do a company. Ian, he saw that the technology would eventually be there to do such a thing. At some point in time in the future, it would be possible. And so for 10 or 15 years, Ian worked on the technology. And together, we got an additional people into the company who were able to further develop the technology and with time to commercialize it. Portal Instruments developed the technology over a series of different iterations. So the original device we had built was a handheld device with a box next to it, which would then deliver the power to the, to the handheld. Once we had done that, we moved to a smaller system. Again, this is everything that you see here, but now in a handheld. Again, this was only able to deliver a smaller volume than we needed, but showed that it was possible to move to a small handheld. This led us to further develop the technology to what we have now, which is a device that delivers large volumes, high viscosity drugs, and has the handheld form factor. You know, as as a technology matures, you have to bring in more and more people with uh, deep areas of expertise around regulatory issues, around uh, safety, and, and so on and so forth. Everyone's uh, highly driven on this important mission to create a new drug delivery technology.